Can we save it? How can I save it? Go, go, go. Life has been kind of crazy. Hibachi, baby. You know, we live this way, but we actually thrive on consistency. Honey I Roam is officially camping again. I cannot tell you how much needed this is. We're in nature, we're gonna have a campfire, we're gonna cook delicious food. I'm gonna change my outfit because it's way colder than I thought. Winston needs a sweater. Oh, look at Winston in his sweater. It's chilly. This is perfect camping weather. Okay, come on. There's one essential item that I picked up on the way to camping and it is, let me get it. Ooh. Boiled peanuts. Here's some firewood. We're finally camping. It was only a week hiatus and that felt really long. Why don't you tell them what we've been up to? We're Honey I Roam. We live in this truck camper and we renovated it. We live in it full time. Yeah, that's our only house, that's it. We've been traveling the country, working hard, driving. We're gonna tell you all about it. And right now, we're gonna have a relaxing camping trip. He's a baby. You want treats? You want some chicken? Huh? The first thing Julietta's gonna do is change. The first thing I'm gonna do is eat boiled peanuts. I get Cajun flavored. Oh, they're nice and warm. They really are. Let me fog they're up my glasses. Steaming. Let's see. Fogged up? Mmm, they smell good. <laughs> Today's video, we're gonna be talking about our upcoming plans, what we think that we're gonna do at the beginning of the year, what we're scared about, what we have no idea about. We're still figuring all this out. We're gonna tell you where we stand as of now. We travel the country trying new jobs out, whether they're challenging, whether they're easy going. We just do all different sorts of jobs and we love, we really love it. It's called work camping. <laughs> <laughs> it's called work camping. <laughs> 2023 was a huge year for us. We worked in three different states. We did three different jobs. We worked freaking hard. Yes, we did. we did. The last job that we did was running a Christmas tree lot on the west coast of Florida, and it was a six week job. I'll link the video up here so you can go check it out. We give you some more information on it. And uh, yeah, we worked 40 days straight, working 10 to 12 hour days. It was really worth it. When we wrapped that up, we had some much needed family time for the holidays. And now that it's January, we're getting back in our camping groove. The first thing I did was fill up our Epic water filter. This is the nano filtration water filter. So that's what we use to have fresh water. And I'm gonna make a coffee. This is actually instant coffee mixed with Four Sigmatic mushroom hot chocolate blend. It's been my afternoon pick me up. Hot chocolate's the best. We're so happy to be at camp. It's been just nonstop the last like month and a half, two months. At every job that we've had recently, we said, oh, I can't wait to have a day where we just relax, where we just relax. Oh yeah, we'll definitely be able to fit that in. Nope, we haven't even been able to do that one day. For us to be able to do the two things that we love the most, camping and making YouTube videos, it's really important to us. So that's gonna be one of our not necessarily resolutions for 2024, but something that we're gonna prioritize. You can't collect firewood here at these state parks, so like chop it down yourself, it's kind of a no-no. So, we didn't have any firewood, we had to buy it. It's $10, it's crazy. It's a $30 fire right there. How much? Amber paid $30 total because we went ahead and got us fire starters too. Like we said, this is a relaxing camping trip. We're making our life easy. We're just going to enjoy a fire at camp. And we're whipping out the Dutch oven. 
we are getting back to our roots. We met so many honeys while we were at the Oldsmar Flea Market selling Christmas trees, and so many of them talked about my cooking. It's time to cook! And I felt guilty, because I haven't really cooked in any videos in the last like year, it hasn't been a priority. We've just been go, go, go. Life has been kind of crazy. And one thing that makes me super happy is cooking and cooking over a fire. So we're gonna do that in this video. <laughs> Reason why Amber and I are even taking this trip is to strategize for 2024 some things that we want to prioritize and one of those things is organization we really want to we want to treat honey i roam as our full-time jobs as our business we've worked camped so many places to supplement the income and we will continue a bit here or there for this year we want to focus on making honey i roam our full-time jobs yeah and so we're going to kind of gather ourselves every single week have a schedule and have a game plan for video content, for brand deals, for things like that that can bring us income while we're videoing, while we're making our YouTube videos. You know, we live this way, but we actually thrive on consistency. In order to have peace of mind at the end of the day, knowing that we did everything, accomplished everything that we feel like we should, we're gonna come up with weekly schedules. So Julieta and I will each have the tasks that we're both good at, best at, we're gonna divide and we're gonna conquer. Yeah, so that's a goal for us for 2024. You know what it's time for? A beer, so I'm gonna review it for you. This is a Gold Cliff IPA. It's made by Kona Brewing. It's a little chillier than I thought it was gonna be, so this is gonna have to transport me mentally. This is an ale brewed with pineapple, tropical. Let's try it. Mm. Smooth, sweet, ale-like, and you know every beer tastes better when you're camping. My hand is freezing. I gotta get a koozie. And as far as work camping goes, we get really excited for that because that gives us the opportunity to live in incredibly beautiful places, have a job, grow a community that's also really important for us while we travel. So we do get really excited for work camping jobs. If you guys have a campground suggestion or somewhere that you know that maybe we should apply for or live put it down in the comments below are you having a good time camping it's about that time it's time to cook the ingredients in tonight's taco soup could it be more simple? You probably already have all of these things in your pantry right now. How much you wanna bet? <laughs> We're starting with some diced onions. That's just one whole onion, dice that up. I cried a lot over it. My eyes, whew. We, ha we also have ground beef and everything else is in cans. So we have a can of black beans, a can of corn. See, I told you you have all this in your pantry. A can of Rotel. We got on that Rotel life when we were living in Texas. We also have taco seasoning. I think that's it. And a campfire and a Dutch oven. When we tell you that we're not exactly sure what we will be doing in 2024, it's the honest truth. We really don't. And I know it sounds exciting and it really is. To be honest, it's pretty scary to be in our mid thirties with no plan, no job. We have no idea what we're gonna be doing. We definitely have faith and we know that we're gonna work hard. We really missed campfires, but we really did not miss all the smoke in our eyes. It is so intense. Can we save it? How can I save it? Just be careful. Oh, smoke in my eye. So we lost about half of our food already. 
the Dutch oven flipped over. <laughs> Meat and onions in the camera. I'm rusty. <laughs> Me and the Dutch oven are rusty. It's okay, that's just the leftovers. You do not need that to be at that. It's basically untouched. Okay. <laughs> that is not untouched. Let's get this dirt out. There we go. We did it. <laughs> We have chili heat with a ranch twist seasoning packet and we have a fajita blend. This is the Kinder's brand. We really like this one. Mixing them in, gonna put them in first. Some black beans. Can of Rotel. Now we're going to let it sit covered for 20 minutes. The soup has just a few more minutes and in that meantime we're going to heat up the tortillas. So we got this really cool grate for over a campfire and you can cook directly on this so you could actually even throw it just on a grill. This is a fire maple product. We'll actually put the link down below. Pretty cool. Oops. that's our Dutch oven taco soup. That was super easy, other than when the Dutch oven fell over, but we recovered. We always recover when we drop something in the fire and we're cooking over a fire. The tortilla dipped in the soup. Mm. Mm. So warm and satisfying, flavorful. You hear that? Yeah, me either. It's so nice. Another wish that we have for 2024 is to take more time for self-care. That can be anything from like getting our hair cut, going to the gym, stretching in the morning, playing games together. So I think we're gonna try to just take things a lot slower, listen to each other more intently, and take time for ourselves, our mental, physical, and spiritual well-being. Um, yeah. That also goes for just like making more time for doing creative things. I know that having a YouTube channel is obviously very creative, but like just hands-on creative stuff like making bracelets or drawing or painting or just doing stuff like that. I feel like I've really been craving that lately just to have something like even when we are at jobs when we were at the tree lot there was some downtime so it would have been fun to be able to kind of do some DIY projects. I've really been pondering over what craft I want to do so if you have any suggestions for crafts please put them down in the comments. I did make this cute little bracelet with my niece just like a tiny bead bracelet and it was really fun and kind of tranquil too. Good morning. Good morning. I can't think of a better way to wake up than to hear Julieta outside talking about self-care and the crackling of a campfire. I'm a sucker for some good self-care. Although we live in this truck camper, I have a four-part skincare routine that I don't neglect. You know what I mean? <laughs> a lot of times we're traveling with such purpose that we don't have time to do a lot of the things. I mean, we don't make time to do those things. So we're just in a rush. You know, we know we have a five hour drive day and we have stops. So it's our own schedule that we're creating out here. I just want to be really good to ourselves. I want to be kind to each other. I want our bodies to last a long time. Whipping out the black stone. That looks so lame. That was ninja style.
Hibachi, baby. This year, we also want to focus on keeping things organized, simple. tidy, simple. Simple is a key word here. We want to simplify. We want to have less things. We want to take really good care of the things that we do have. What is he doing? He's such a cute baby. Breakfast tacos. The flies. Mm. A little queso on there, some sour cream, hot sauce. Use some more hot sauce. The tortillas are nice and crispy. Mm hmm. <laughs> you got more right there, Since we're not going to be at a work camping job, what you can expect from Honey Eye Rome in the next couple months is just traveling and camping. Straight up camping for enjoyment. We're probably going to go up to the Carolinas, see some mountains, while we figure out what our next work camping job is for the summer. Stay tuned. This year is going to be filled with adventures, mystery, things that we have no idea of what we're even going to be doing. All we can do is plan to be our best. You're here with us and we couldn't be more grateful. Thank you so much for watching. We're Honey I Roam and we love you. Look at your little crooked ears. What are you here? <laughs> and that's a wrap. Do the intro. Holy moly. Wait, I feel like this. Do you like this lighting? I feel like it's kind of weird. Nope, we haven't even. This, the shot. Oh. This is so funny with all the smoke behind me. It looks like I'm at a club or something. What do you think? <laughs> I think that's when, good. when.